everyone, this is Tao and welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing a review slash lip swatch on my NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream. I have four colors and this was requested by some of you, you know, in my last haul video. I figured that it was time to do it and right now I'm rocking the color Copenhagen. So I only have four shades and I know they have a wide range of shades but these four are the ones that attracted me most before we get into the lip swatches and arm swatches i want to sh talk to you a little bit about these these are just my two cents and so these retail for around seven dollars um you can get them at nyx cosmetics website or ulta and they come in a little container like a lip they, they look like lip gloss it comes with a sponge tip applicator and when you first put them on it is a drier consistency it's not like a lip gloss um, and it's even drier than a, like a lipstick it's almost crumbly in texture and then uh, you smooth it out if you smooth it out on your lip and it is a very smooth consistency it almost feels like velvet it's very very pigmented and you put it on your lips let it dry like a minute or so and it sets and once it sets it is pretty transfer resistant um, for a bright color like this I can rock it for a few hours without any you know signs of wearing now in terms of how it feels I will have to say that this is not the most moisturizing formula there is it is a matte finish though so I mean you will you will kind of have to expect that from a matte lip product I mean granted I know that like bite beauty has some matte, some amazing matte lip products that are not drying but these for this price point it's not bad it doesn't completely dry on my lips but you have to make sure that your lips are well exfoliated moisturized before you put these on otherwise it does uh, emphasize the fine lines and you know wrinkles of your lip. Without further ado, enough rambling, let's go ahead and uh, look at how it looks on the lips. So first up we have Antwerp which is a bright pinky coral. It is a very fitting summer shade. I know we're heading into the colder season but this is a great bright summery shade. So that's how Antwerp looks and that's how it looks like actually far away. And then next up we have Prague, which I thought would be a dusty rose color, but it actually goes on a brighter mauve pink. It's a little brighter than I anticipated, but still very wearable. It's a really great office everyday color. So that's how it looks on my skin tone. And here to show you how transfer resistant the shade is. So I'm just kissing the back of my hand. And you can see a little color wear off, but it's not that much. And next up, we have Monte Carlo, which is a true blue base red. It's one of my favorite shades of the bunch. Actually, in the whole collection. But it is a very face brightening shade. It's a perfect matte red. I love this shade. That's Monte Carlo. And last but not least, we have Copenhagen, which goes on a little more blotchy than the rest of the shades, so you have to layer it. But it's a very pretty deep um, berry-based maroon shade. You can share it out as a stain, but you can also wear it full force, like that. It's a really vampy, great for fall, winter. Um, so here's a hand swatch, Antwerp. We have Prague, we have Monte Carlo, and Copenhagen. So all in all, I love these products. Yes, it is drying. Yes, it does take a little bit of um, building up to make sure the color is even and it looks nice. And you know, you want to make sure that when you use the sponge tip, it you want to be careful when you apply it so it is um, as precise as you want it to be. I personally think it's worth it to go through all that trouble for full pigmentation for a long wearing affordable product to have for you know fall and winter especially if you like that 
matte look on the scale from 0 to 10 I will give this a 9 go ahead and try these out um, I would suggest wait for a sale holiday season's coming on there's gonna be Black Friday Cyber Monday sales for days and I would strongly recommend that you at least pick up a couple shades I would strongly recommend Monte Carlo that's what I have for you today thank you so much for watching don't forget to follow me on Instagram it's I am grape 1119 so uh, thank you and I will see you guys in the next video <laughs> bye bye